everyone. I am Miss Anna, your Boholana teacher. I am from Baklayon. Shout out to tanan mga taga Baklayon diha, sa tanan mga taga Bohol. Kumusta mo tanan? Hinaw ka na mo sa mga maayong panglawas and uh, please 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 follow the uh, precautionary measures ng impose sa tong government. Keep social distancing, keep physical distancing for us to help stop spreading this uh, coronavirus. Okay? Now the question is, how much really is the salary of a Filipino teacher here in Saudi Arabia? Alright, in my personal experience, uh, since I am teaching in an international school following an American curriculum, my basic salary during my first contract was 3,000 reals. Reals is the Saudi uh, currency. Okay, and along with it, the school provided us with a 300 reals food allowance. So that is in total of 3,300 reals, okay? Or around 45,000 pesos, depending on uh, the value of uh, reals to pesos. Now, on my second contract, gidugangan sa school of 200 reals ang among basic pay. So that is now 3,200 plus um, another 300 reals for your food allowance. So, in total of 3,500 uh, something na pay gamayng sobra sa 500 reals, okay? So, if you're going to convert that, that's around 48,000? Hindi naman ka. Okay, kamo na lang convert if you have time. Is it big enough? I, I don't think so, okay? Now, what is the good thing about teaching here? Alright? I like it here so much. Why? Because the school is already providing me or us with an accommodation. We have villa here. I mean, we are living in a villa together with my co-Filipino teachers from the different parts of the country. Some are from Nueva Ecija, from Batangas, from from um, Cagayan Valley, Oguban pang mga lugar sa Pilipinas, and we're all very good friends here. We're like family. Okay, going back. Now, the school. Okay, so going back. Now, uh, the school provided us with an accommodation, okay, and transportation. Alright, we have a shuttle, or we have this thing called a van. Kung sa ato apa. So every morning and every time we get back here, um, na ami service. And the good thing is, uh, the distance from our villa to the school is just very near. It could just take around a three minutes walk from here. But the thing is, you are allowed to walk in just a shorter distance. But since it's hot here, uh, of course, dili lale masunog ang panit na sa mo na. Okay, now. The earning doesn't end there. Why? Because um, I'm lucky enough to have this privilege and this opportunity uh, tutorial pa after class or after school. So I to say... Uh, if you are industrious enough, if you are really aiming to get bigger earning, then you have to go for a tutorial. And besides, sayang po dangin mo ang mga oras kung inigabot mo dili sa villa at around 2.30 and inikaw man na wala na kay buhaton. So, what else would you do? You have to spend it for tutorial. Okay, may na lang po. And the tutorial here is, you know, it, it could give you bigger impact. It could really help you. It could really help you a lot. Okay. The good thing about having that amount here of salary is that you don't have to pay uh, taxes, you don't have to pay monthly contributions, whatever you're earning for that month, imuha na judna. And the good thing also is that, walay, I mean, dili kaayo dako ang tax sa mga palitunon diri sa Saudi Arabia. So, whatever you're earning, imuha na judna. Dili, pa, dili ba pariha sa ato ang, uh, for example, uh, na pa deduction sa SSS, na pa deduction sa GSIS. I mean, I have nothing against it. It could help you really in the long run. But I'm talking about, you know, how much could you, you know, how much money will will be left every month, all right? So if there's salary, there's also expenses, all right? So uh, let's talk about so the expenses now. Me personally, um, the monthly expense that I have is internet, okay? So the internet package that I am using is worth 
150 reals and that is unlimited okay unlimited internet sorry that is unlimited internet okay aside the internet i have to spend for my food the prices of the commodities here is um baba airplane may aeroplano nila ba Well, anyway, going back. Okay, so the good thing about the commodities here in Saudi Arabia is not very expensive. Kung ikumpara sa atua, murag pari pari hora siyag presyo sa atua. But the thing is, listen, gaayo ipalit sa atua kay, you know, the, the, the money is limited. Sa food expenses, usahay ang ako ang budget. Kung mga unwig lami na dyan kayo, niya mag-bake-bake ni, kaya nga mga kaubang dyan kaya mahilig man mag-bake-bake. Maybe it's around uh, 500, 300 to 500 riyals per month. Okay, busog na kay ka, Ana. Dili na kay ka, makaluluoy ka ayaw pang minaw, Ana. Makakaon na ka, Ana, sa um, restaurant nga gusto ni mo. And of course, your personal, uh, you know, your, your personal needs like conditioner, imuhang sabon, toothpaste. Bili kay siya dako o gasto. Bili ay siya dako o gasto. So maybe uh, for my personal need along with the grocery, maybe it's around 1,000 reals per month. So pila naman to. We have the internet for 150 reals and we have, you know, the 1,000 reals for uh, my personal needs. So that's around 1,150 reals. And of course, you have to consider um, in the health Uber fare. Sometimes when you go to grocery stores, um, you have to pay. Uh, the minimum here for Uber fare is 15 reals. That's the minimum. And of course, you don't always go out to buy for groceries, right? Sometimes we go for groceries two times in a month, like every after two weeks. And that's it. Ang tanan ni mong mahibiling, it's, it's for you already. Okay? And remember, ning racket ka, na kay mga tutorials. So it's just a matter of being industrious. And the good thing is, walay hang out and They don't have bars here. I mean, you know. Uh, clubs they don't have. They don't have uh, sinihan. Uh, actually, na ana na, na yung sinihan, but in in few malls pa. Because Saudi Arabia is starting to be opened now. Okay, so so you won't be tempted to spend your money in some other unnecessary things like hanging out with friends or uh, drinking party party. No, when you come here, it's about work, work, work. Okay, is it easy to be here? Of course not. Walay walay pag abroad, walay pag trabaho abroad niya dali. Yeah, all you have to do is to do your thing, respect other people, pray, pray, pray. Mao jud na ang akong ikaingon. Na ang lagi magsigi og view, view para sa mga tapad. Kusa man ha, ako ang tao sa ani. Ako sa nakakita ni mo, kita mo na diha ko an. Medyo ngit-ngit na no. It's because it's about 6 p.m. And should you have any questions or any comments, please don't hesitate to uh, write it down below so I can um, read and I can, you know, walk you through or I can help you out with it. Just please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell button so that you'll be notified kung sa paman ang akong mga upcoming videos. Okay, thank you once again for watching. This is me again, your Langa, your Bohongana teacher, Miss Anna. And may you have a great day. Don't forget to pray. Bye!